Adventurous kids explore with education and learning what a wildlife is in the Everglades. I want to explore the museum of discovery science. What plants do butterflies like? I want to know about Key West. Adventurous kids learning and fun. Adventurous kids. Today I'm going to tell you about the Earth. Earth is one of the eight planets that orbit or travel around the Sun in the solar system. It is the third planet from the Sun. Earth is the only planet that isn't named after a god. Earth comes from an old English and Germanic words meaning the ground. People often think of Earth as a giant sphere, and in fact, it's shape is more like a squished ball that bulges out at the equator, an imaginary line around the middle of the planet, exactly between the North Pole and the South Pole. Its bulge is caused by the Earth spinning the effect of gravity. Scientists nicknamed our planet the Blue Marble because it looks like a blue and white marble when we see it from outer space. The blue is water, which covers most of the surface of the Earth. Clouds and bodies of ice, such as Antarctica, appear white, while the landforms look brownish. Earth is the only planet in the solar system that can support life. Life is possible on Earth because the planet has water on its surface and oxygen gas in its air. Earth also has the perfect range of temperatures of life. It's not too hot, like Venus and not too cold like Neptune. The average temperature on Earth is about 59 degrees Fahrenheit. Earth is the fifth largest planet in the solar system. It is made up of three layers, the core, the mantle, and the crust. Plants, animals, and people live on the crust. Land covers about 30% of Earth's surface. Land is divided into seven huge pieces called continents. Water covers about 70% of Earth's surface. This water is in the form of oceans, rivers, lakes, and groundwater. Earth is the only planet that has water in liquid form on its surface. The layer of gases surrounding Earth is called the atmosphere. This is the air that living things breathe. Earth's atmosphere goes up to a few hundred miles above the surface. The atmosphere gets thinner as it gets farther on the surface. It contains mostly water vapor and it gathers nitrogen 77% and oxygen 21%. Like all planets, Earth has two types of motion, orbit and spin. Its orbit is the path it takes around the Sun. It takes Earth 365.25 days to go around the Sun once. This is equal to one calendar year. The force that keeps Earth orbiting the Sun is called gravity. The Earth orbits the Sun at a speed of 67,000 miles per hour. Earth also spins or rotates around its axis. The axis is an imaginary line that runs through the Earth's center from the North Pole to the South Pole. Earth completes one rotation in 24 hours. This is equal to one day. Earth has one natural satellite called the Moon. A satellite is an object in space that orbits around another object of a larger size. The Moon is about 239,000 miles from Earth. The Earth's moon is the fifth largest moon in the solar system. Our amazing planet has been around for quite some time. By researching our planet's rocks, scientists have calculated the Earth to be around 4.5 billion years old. Earth's surface has changed greatly since it was first formed. Some changes have taken place over millions of years as wind and water have eroded or worn away the land. Erosion has created features such as the Grand Canyon. Other changes have happened very quickly. The force of an erupting volcano or an earthquake can change the surrounding land in just hours. Thanks for watching this Adventurous Kids episode. What did you learn today? Adventurous Kids. Adventurous Kids. What was the most interesting fact? Adventurous kids. Adventurous kids. Adventure. Adventure.